and welcome to Setville. This is our Leavers video. We really hope you enjoy it. So, uh, what do you want to be when you're older? Who are you going to be? I want to be a pilot. Um, I want to be married to Prince Harry. Uh, happy. <laughs> Hairdresser. A makeup person. I want to be an astrophysicist. I want to be a wag. I want to be a pilot in the RAF. Aww. I want to be a pilot in the RAF. <laughs> a fish. Once upon a time, I wanted to destroy the world. I can't anymore though, because North Korea has now come along with nuclear weapons. I want to be a really, really fake person with loads of fake eyelashes and fake hair extensions and fake tan. A tree surgeon! I'd quite like to be uh, an engineer and architect. Yeah, I want to be a pilot as it goes through. Yeah, I want to be a bit of a football coach as it goes. Uh, I want to be a drama teacher, I think. A drummer. A musician. I want to be in the RAF. So, uh, who's your favourite teacher? This is mine. Mr. Wilcox. Mr. Raheem. <laughs> Simply because he just makes me smile. Roberts. There's got to be Roberts, Roberts. Maywood, Martin, Trini, Curry, yeah. Mr. Atrill. Curry. Uh, got to be Beasley. Oh, Mr. Romson, couldn't forget Roberts. you. Um, geography, love it. Uh, Mr. Latish, he's really nice. He's got mi mis I'd say Mr. Atrill. Yeah, it's because he's so, so fat. Mr. Smith. Mr. Smith. Mr. Smith. <laughs> he's not a teacher, but he Mr. Is. Smith. Uh, Mr. Beast. Miss Copus. Uh, Miss Howard. Oh, Miss Stewart. I like Miss Stewart. <laughs> Mr. Curry. Why? Because he has taught me to get out on the field and consume a perfect diet so I can have this masculine form. Miss Drendisby, Miss Milliken, Miss Fisher, uh, Miss McCormick, Miss Beckenham, uh, Miss Sands, Cooper. Oh, I do like Andrews. Mr. Ping, Mr. Pete, Mr. Janelle, Mr. Janelle, I'm the team. Oh, Miss Barnes. Mr. Doe Jackson, Mr. Austin, oh. Mr. McCleverty, very fun with maths. Um. <laughs> Students, you will never forget and why. Um, it's probably got to be Phil Lloyd, uh, just because he's wrong on every level. I uh, get on very well with Matt Riley. He's yep. a good guy, he's always there helping people out. Sean Benson, yeah, Sean's, Sean's interesting. George Rosa, George Rosa for, for running away from me when he'd thrown a snowball. And he was too scared to stay and face the music. I think it probably is Jack, having been uh, our class concern, he's always been so stupid. But Fleur Walsh for just being interestingly annoying for most of the two years that I taught her. Obviously Oliver Collett, it would be rude not to mention him, he is so, after all, Boris Johnson the unforgettable. Uh, who else won't I forget? People who poke their noses in where they shouldn't be, so clearly Henry Groves who has the features requisite for such a task. What's Tom, what's Tom name? What's Tom name? Tom Radcliffe. Tom Radcliffe, yeah. All of you that do geography, you've been wonderful. I hope that's inspiring. Spectacular. Amazing. Awesome. Eventful. Crazy. Crap. That was great. Interesting. Inspiring. Hilarious. Splendid. Good. I don't know. I'll go for the fun, yeah? Yeah. <laughs> Top. Different. Ferocious. No. Amazing! Long. Interesting. Alright. Mixed. Manic. It's fabulous. It's quite strange. Yes. Right. Fantastic! Woo! Unbelievable. Bully. <laughs> <laughs> Chill. 
cheek different. It's been, it's been terrible, okay? Okay. Is that good? It's actually going to have to be uh, Rapunzel from Tangled. Uh, I'd love to be Princess Jasmine out of Aladdin, just because she has some lovely satin trousers. Nemo. Pluto! Winnie the Pooh. Blue from Jungle. Tigger, because it bounces up and down a lot. And that's something I'm quite, you know, quite fond of. <laughs> Tigger. It's got to be Buzz Lightyear. Yeah. It's got to be Buzz Lightyear. Yeah. To be honest, I like to think I am Buzz Lightyear yeah, sometimes. Aladdin. Cinderella. Say Mickey Mouse because yeah, everyone wants to be Mickey Mouse. Uh, I'd be Nala then, obviously. Nemo <laughs> 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 because he's orange. Probably Pinocchio. Probably Winnie the Pooh because he attracts children. <laughs> <laughs> or I'd be the Red Lobster. Oh, sweet. I'd have to be a prince. Hey, I'd be Dumbo. Snow White. Or the cleavage. Eeyore because it sleeps all the time. Piglet. I would be the guy from Aris the Cats. Don't you mean aristocrats? Arist <laughs> the aristocrats. <laughs> Same thing as you do. Buzz Lightyear? Donald Duck. Cinderella! Who's in beauty? Uh, probably the... Uh, yeah. My doll! <laughs> <laughs> Who's in beauty? Um, Who's in beauty? Skip to the next question. <laughs> Um, I think it's got to be with my year 11 class. Um, their stories they keep telling me every time they have a weekend away from this place. I think the stories of Ollie and Tesco is quite funny. Um, the stories of Ollie and his one minute wonder. Um, Yayan and his amazing skills at parties. So I think just listening to all the gossip from the weekend is quite funny. Oh, uh, Mr May would definitely because anything to make him look silly really, but I don't have anything specific. I heard that street. <laughs> I've never liked him. <laughs> I've never liked you either because you're small and ginger. <laughs> Better than being big and bald. Oh. <laughs> uh, that's banter, not bullying. <laughs> My most memorable moment came to you from year nine, when in the middle of an issue, a year 12 picked up my orange and used it as a weapon to throw against another year 12. It was followed by a large crowd of people, a crowd of which contained bullies and chavs. But I, I was happy nonetheless and I ran after the year 12 and I came to them and I said, please, for the love of God, give me back my orange. It was my first lesson with Mr Andrews. Oh, watching the England match in the hall. Oh, when I met Matt. Oh, no, Shut up, you corny bastard. You seen Charlie Dixon? Myself and Oliver Collins enjoyed being stoned before school. Ah, <laughs> 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 oh, when Matt went there, yeah. Broke that frame in Germany, that was so funny. Yeah, yeah. yeah I agree. That was, I, I wasn't there, but I agree. <laughs> When I was in year seven and they pulled pranks on their last day and they put cleans all over the toilet and I actually squeezed myself. Oh, look at that, year 11! Yeah. Calling Mr. Wilcox a crusty dude. Yeah, year nine, that's a good one. Right? When well, I threw up in cricket and myself. It has to be the first time I ever heard Curry go, Get off the field! So, uh, if you had to get rid of a dead body, how would you do it? And uh, who would you get to help you? What? I'd probably get rid of a dead body by chucking it in a vat of acid. I'd ask Mr. Smith. <laughs> and uh, just let him get on with it. <laughs> First of all, I'd sort of touch the body and see what it's not like. <laughs> and also made me feel it and, <laughs> and then I'd probably uh, put it in my collection. I would ask for Sean's help um, because he has expertise in being a complete... Phil! I'd definitely ask Phil for help with the dead body. Um, he knows his stuff really. In Phil Lloyd's transit. Phil Lloyd's, Your mum? Phil Lloyd's transit. Hey. Uh, Phil. I 
we all know, it feels like he's had training in this, hasn't he? Uh, yeah, Phil, he's probably take the blame just so he can do stuff with it. I think you can all use your imaginations there. Do you have any last messages for anyone? Probably Sean Benson, really, you've got to improve your music taste. It's very, very poor. Work hard, look after each other, and enjoy your life. If I haven't said it already, um, good luck. I would like to say, morning, Sean, morning. <laughs> <laughs> Basically, I do know who uh, put something in my tea. Um, enjoy your summer, you've worked hard to get there, and look forward to seeing you in September. Dudes, you're sick. Hashtag year 11. <laughs> Hello, KY, it's me. Um, so, obviously, I'm really sorry I can't see you to the end. I'm sorry I can't see you all the way through your 10th and year 11. Um, this is just a little message for you when you finish in year 11, which is only some two and a half terms away. Let's have a great life, and I'll, uh, I'll be at your funeral. I love everyone at Sackville. Even the people that have bitched about me. I love you. <laughs> yeah, everyone in year 11, you guys are just the Don. Bye. Yeah, good luck. All that really matters is Stay classy. Come and get me. I'm sorry that some of you are actually leaving, leaving, and won't be coming back in the sixth form because we will miss you. Yes, it'll be sad to see you go. Um, take care, live long, and prosper. In the words of Mr. Spock. Just, guys, get out there. Um Go for what you want. You're a fantastic group. You're oozing talent. Go out there, get what you want, and you know, have a wonderful life.